My friend Dennis went to Nashville a while back, a couple of weeks I guess now, and purchased three instruments. And this is one of the ones that he got. It's Cordoba T30, all solid mahogany. So what, what are my impressions of this ukulele? One, that is a very attractive headstock. Very attractive, very nice. This is an extremely lightweight ukulele. Phyllis was talking about her ukulele that is all solid, I think, in you. And she talks about how heavy it is. Well, this is light. It almost floats. It's a tenor ukulele. So it's bigger, you know, it's a, a bigger uke. It is lovely. Lovely, lovely. The problem with this ukulele <laughs> is that it's expensive and I don't feel real comfortable playing an expensive ukulele honestly if the uke costs more than two hundred dollars I really uh, I worry about it a little bit it's like I want to take out an insurance policy As you see, does not come with strap buttons. Does, or did, come with a very fine gig bag. Now the person who purchased this obviously didn't play it at all. First thing Dennis did was change the strings. I don't know why, but he did. Okay. So there, it is a beauty. Honestly, I'm more comfortable playing the, the caramel tenors. Of course, they come with everything you need, including strap buttons. Uh, they come with strap, strap buttons, electronics. They come with everything you need. And the price is such that if you ran over it with your car, you wouldn't be devastated. If I ran over this with my car, then I'd also get under the wheel and run over myself. <laughs> but that's just me. If you want an exquisite ukulele for what really is a low dollar price compared to expensive tenor ukuleles then this one might satisfy i mean caramel's 89.99 acacia is amazing and wonderful this at 429 is amazing and wonderful and I expect that the uh, ones made in Hawaii that sell for $2,500 are amazing and wonderful.
which one do you want? How much do you want to pay? They're all going to do the same thing. And if you can play ukulele, you will sound great on that caramel tenor. And how much better is this one going to sound than that one? Well, to my ear, the other one sounds better right now because I'm used to playing those. I'm used to the strings and I'm used to the sound of it. I suppose if I restricted myself to this ukulele for a, for a month, I wouldn't be able to tolerate anything else. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's pretty. Thanks for watching.